All right, people, here we go. We'll look at this engine today. This is the Nova Rossi uh, P5. It's the updated version. I think uh, 2019 uh, version they updated it. This is a good engine. It's a five port. Um, it's what they consider a long stroke. I got this engine for a good price and uh, from a buddy. So I'm just trying to stack up on my Nova Rossi because you never know what's going on with Nova Rossi right now. So I'm trying to stack up on my Novi. This is brand new. And we're going to take a look at it and take it apart show you what's popping with it. All right. All right. So open it up. Of course, you got the regular doohickey. He got left, left me some treats. I think he was running a Mugen uh, MBX8 that he never ran. Clutch bell, cool. Some shoes. You know the regular paperwork. Y'all know all this. You don't need to get in that. Y'all know all that. Alright, so move this to the side. Alright, there she is right there. Um, I got this because the price was good. I don't know what I'm going to do with it, but... Um, I don't know. Maybe I'll get it modified or something. Who knows? I don't know. But it's good to have. It could be a practice motor or something. But I will race with this. This P5 is a good engine. Um, it has a 6.5 in there. Nice. And um, also has a long needle. You can see that? Carb. Uh, it's three needle carb. Booyah. Yeah, three needle. Not bad, not bad at all. Uh, I'm gonna take it apart, and see what it do, you know. But that's the head, and you can see on the on the block it says it's 2019. They they updated it. Um, the P5. This engine was out, you know, it's been out for a while, but this is the updated version, 2019. All right. So let's take it apart, see what it's hitting for. See inside there. All right, man, them screws is long. All right. That's the head. Let's see. Uh, it's not no center of gravity head, but you know, hey, it works, right? Low center of gravity, but you know, hey, it works. Uh, button head. Now look, this button head is the same as that um manifesto, that uh twenty eight o two eight, and um I'm gonna show y'all something with that manifesto too. See O ring on there. Mm -hmm. and you can see uh, doesn't have the uh, team edition head with the dimple, but you know, hey, right, let's take the back plate off. Remember, piston, top dead center. Back plate. Usual cut in the back. See that rod? Now this has the R7 rod on there. See it? Alright, let's get that out of there. So we can get that up out of there. Leave. Like I said, this is a five port intake side. Let me make sure y'all in there. Good intake side. Push ports on the side there. Exhaust.
this thing out. Piston. And this does have the R7 rod, unlike the um, Manifesto. Let me check the compression, but it should be good. <clears throat> this thing ain't never ran, so yeah. Crank, hold on, I gotta get the crank off. Da -da 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 -da. Get the crank out. know what it's hitting about huddy duddy and it came right off no issues Boom. now this crank is not DLC coated like the manifesto but it is filled I do have it filled No slug or weight or balance, but it does have cuts. This is not rust, this is like um, machining oil in there. Good, cool. Doesn't have the uh, 17001 bearing, double seal, but it's just a regular steel bearings. But it looks good. That, that um, low speed needle is really in there. I wonder about that. Alright, so people, that's it. Um, let me check something. Oh, hold on. Let's look at something here. It's the uh, Manifesto four port, right? Yeah, we've seen that already. Hold on. Let's see, you can see it's the Manifesto button head. So, this button head, y'all probably can't see the number, but it's the same one there. All right. But let's compare the cranks. It's the Manifesto crank. See it's DLC coated, slug or weight in there, but not filled. I don't know why, but it's not filled. So look at them cranks. Similar, right? Cuts look a little similar, maybe. This one, this one open in here, man. See if I can see it. Here. This opening here may be a little bit smaller than that one. Then it could be some timing things. The timing might be a little different as far as the timing opening. You know what I mean? So, that's it, people. Alright. So, this is your man, Raj 111 Just wanted to show you all that. I don't know what I'm going to do with this motor. I got it for a good price, so... Probably be like a backup or practice mode or something. Who knows? I don't know. We'll see. Um, bear with me, people. I'm dealing with a lot of stuff right now. I ain't been really on YouTube like that to answer questions and stuff. But just bear with me. I'll be back soon, all right? All right, this is your man, Raj 11 See you on the next one. Peace.